All right, so my name is Medas Falajimo. I'm privileged to be a uh, team lead on Plan B Express. And now, uh, so opportunity we have for us is called PNET. But quickly, I want to show you also, why do we take this opportunity very seriously? Let's look at the case study of Nigeria. And I'm looking at the case study of Nigeria. Presently, the inflation rate of Nigeria is ranging between 32 to 34% inflation rate, right? That is the level of money losing value in the Nigeria. Right now, we're looking at average of about 32%. So presently, about 32% so to uh, about 34%. That's how we're battling. So that means the, the bottom, or we can see support line of our inflation rate in Nigeria right now, it's ranging from 30%. You know, even if before now, we have asked, as bad as, you know, back to 22, 26% inflation rate. And now, so you came to attend and ask us that, okay, what best investment can I do in such economy where you have inflation at the range of 32.7 or 32.15? Now that come to come to diff, different opportunity that people diversify into. It's only those of you, probably, you have a friend that works in the bank and encourage you about the the capital market. You know, we have different market as it were, and people have encouraged you about the capital market that it has been boosted so much. Yes, fine, it's true, it has been boosted, but you're contending with what we call 25% or recoverable loss in the manufacturing company. So that is, if I'm competing, uh, creating a company and that has to do with manufacturing, you have to rule out the first 25% cutoff that you're battling with 75%. So in Nigeria case, now any investment you are investing, with the local currency or domicile Nigeria currency, so you are battling with 32% inflation rate. So if you cannot make above 32%, all right, APY, which is very, very grossly impossible, no financial institution is going to offer you that, then you are actually not having value for your money. So take that to mind. And now an example I will show that is there's a platform here where you talk about different investments. So at why? You talk about different investment in capital market, talk about stock, that's local stock, not even foreign stock and all of that. You talk about the money market, which has to do array of mutual fund and all of that. And so the highest we could have in some time that was increased recently by the central bank was about 18 to 22%. All right. Now, if you look at it, annual yield returns of this about 18 to 47%. So we have Highest we have was about 19 to 22% mutual fund. You have savings that you talk about different money market games and all of that that's going to give you creating, and this is going to give you about 13%. I'm just going through different opportunity and investing. Most time when you tell people, they say, um, I rather have to keep my money in money market. I rather have to keep my money in fees deposit and all of that. So I'm just showing you a diverse opportunity. And if you say you want to up to even the foreign uh, savings and all of that, you're going to see very ridiculous percentage, about 4% APR. Yeah, annual yield you're going to accumulate on your dollar, as it were. And then if you want to go to other plans, you're going to see a very ridiculous percentage that actually you want to uh, do investment in as far as maybe mutual fund is concerned. Now, I'm not taking us around to this to come and invest here. I'm just showing you an example and how it actually works for you to maybe somebody is going to be advising you about the investing, about uh, money market and all the like. And then you're going to say, OK, I think I need to keep my money in the place and secure. Look at it, the investing mutual fund in dollar. <laughs> you're talking about 0.5% APY. Now, so of course, you can say, OK, the dollar is only inflating against itself. And, but of course, you know that it's losing value against asset and all of that. So that's why we have an opportunity for you. Uh, I'm not going to sweet talk you just to tell you. We have counted a lot of things after now. Probably you are in a group. They have sent you a message about the online booking. Talk about the uh, trading platform. Talked about the, um, you know, um, what do we call it? Um, E-commerce system and all the like for the company. Now, so we now come to talk about cryptocurrency as it were. And one of the biggest errors or major most persons get afraid about when we talk them to them about cryptocurrency, well, it's not their fault because their level of understanding. That takes us to the aspect of what we call um, not going to about a return, okay? We talk about the return, so monthly return of cryptocurrency like Bitcoin, all right? So most time people keep money and one of the things they actually missed out of the uh, return on Bitcoin annual reward or return in Bitcoin is the fact that 
it's quite difficult for them to be able to uh, settle down and make money. For instance, we have like Bitcoin 2024, because there are level of knowledge you need to understand to be able to uh, make money and hold your money in crypto. And that's where the professionalism come to. But no matter how professional you are, you can make money and lose money. And our tough friend has said, the easiest place to make money is crypto, but the, the most difficult place to hold money is crypto because you will see somebody that say, I made a lot of money. For instance, we see the first quarter of this year for Bitcoin. The first quarter was blossom for Bitcoin, which give about 68% point, 68.68% uh, 68 .68%, uh, return if you bought Bitcoin the month of, you know, beginning of the year and to the first quarter, that's after three months, you have gotten this right. Now, in the second quarter, that lost about 11%. So perhaps somebody who come into Bitcoin to just buy, oh, I'll hand about Bitcoin because that's one of the most aspects people want to buy into. And then they bought Bitcoin in that second quarter for three months. At the end of three months, this is what they have. And these are part of the thing that make them to run away. Oh, this not is highly volatile. I can tell you tomorrow, there are bigger investors who never love anything cryptocurrency because of instability. However, it's their level of ignorance. But we're just telling you uh, things that should create a balance for you. Then we have the third quarter. It actually not ended in negative, but that's a percentage growth of about 0.96%, all right? Then you have the fourth quarter we are. So far, the beginning of October we are now, up to now, the value of Bitcoin had lost about 1.01%. Now, if you go back to Ethereum, for anyone who probably is holding Ethereum, had lost this second, only first quarter so far, the second quarter had lost, the third quarter has lost, and the fourth quarter so far about six point something percent loss. You can down now. So then, if you look at Bitcoin in twenty twenty four, right so far in the monthly activities, January, February, March. Of course, that's why you saw we ended in profit at the first quarter, and then the month of April was not good, and immediately on the month of uh, May and the month of June was not good. July was a bit, just two percent, and then we have. August, 8 point something percent negative. September, 7 point something. And this one, we are still negative. Now, if you look at it cumulatively, if you accumulate the quarter together, you can agree that for anyone who probably have invested, however, it's still better than, you know, the uh, fiat investment like the Naira dollar investment and all of that. But that's one of the major area where they actually have problem. Now, if we go back to 2022, probably when we're in the bear market, the month of January was an error. The month of February was an error. All right. And the first quarter, second quarter, third quarter to the last quarter was a turmoil. All right. And so that's now what put people, a lot of people off to say, oh, I don't think I can invest. And the month of January 2022, only these two months and the others will have much of negative, which has to do with uh, a beer market. Now, why am I showing you all of this? Hello. Somebody says I have to check my mic. If you can hear me loud and clear, please can you type one 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 on the chat box, everybody. If you can hear me no very too, loud. Sir. Not to somebody is saying there's no voice there. No voice there. That's oh. why I said to check with mic. Not to you. Please go ahead. Okay. Okay. So now that's want us to show you that when talking about investing, reward, and all of that. Now, I noticed some important aspect is that. So I'm just telling us about what we diversify into. I told friends, especially if you're in Nigeria. In fact, for me, anyone who need much of, you know, alternative investment is people that live in Nigeria. And to look at this scenario, if you live in Nigeria, I've just told you that you are battling with inflation rate of about 32% minimum, right? Or let's say 30% minimum inflation rate. So what investment am I going to do in Naira that we're able to cover the inflation and battle to even make profit? That's going to be very difficult. Now I say, okay, what's the solution for you? That means you need to invest in a hard currency, which means I need to diversify and up my game into a hard currency with the dollar, euro, pounds. Now you may say, okay, those of you have Jackpot, I'm in London, I'm in Canada, wherever. So that means I do not have the problem in Nigeria. The problem you have, people who are in Nigeria, they are spending in Naira, like you're buying fuel at 1,350 or 1,500, which I know man can get to 2,000 Naira per liter. Now you're going to be battling with Naira. And I said the best solution is that, okay, just learn how to spend in Naira, but make in dollar. You won't feel the heat so much. I said, okay, what about somebody who is in you know foreign country where you're making the dollar? Will you not feel the heat? Oh, you will feel the heat because the inflation rate you can get is about 2 point something percent, if I'm not mistaken. That means the dollar is losing its value on its own. So that means the challenge you have if you're in foreign country, you are, you are making money in dollar, but it's one to one. That is one ratio one. So as long as losing value, then you're actually going to be struggling because 
you make one dollar, you are going to spend your expenses in that one dollar. So that's one to one. But that's okay. The best solution you can have is to find a place where you can have making money in hard currency, in hard or asset. So if you are in Nigeria, make money in hard currencies. If you are in foreign country, you are in America and Oliver, learn how to make money in asset. And the best, and most time, I'm not saying real estate is not a good deal, but I will disappoint you today to tell you that if you are investing in real estate, the money you invest in real estate should not be your running capital. It's actually a fallback capital, meaning not a cash flow you invest in real estate. Okay, because why? If I lie, many of you may be a banker listening to me, go to your bank and ask, why is that that bank does not give loan for real estate business? Because it's referred to as a liquid asset. A liquid asset is difficult for people to recover their money or loan given to anybody involved in it. And that's one of the major problems because it's not a cash flow system. So for that, so what do I need to have? I need to learn how to make money in a digital asset. Many of you wouldn't know ETF, all of those things that was ETF. Probably you, do, you wouldn't know the importance of those things they are doing so that we can take over the digital asset where we can, you know, diversify our money to. One of the prompt area of digital asset that people have been investing to much activities for a very long time to diversify and hedge their money against inflation have been gold. And we now say that, okay, one of the biggest aspects that Stripe go to run very high is bad government policies, struggling inflations and all of that, and crisis. And because everyone is going to look for safe havens. And that's why some of those currencies that are go related like XND and all of that always have a strive to move up at the time of crisis. Now, quickly, let's look at, now going to the crypto as a well. Now, we come to look at, we said, we look at different cryptocurrencies opportunity investing. Why do we now look at investing into this opportunity? Now, many of you have watched uh, the video that just played out. And the video that just played out was that, hey, you know what? The video that just played out was, you know what? In all this aspect, in all this aspect was that you have a project that is creating an ecosystem of utility. And so you have people who are like hedge fund managers or uh, venture capitalists into the platform because either you are a retail investor or whatever, you are gathering liquidity to such company to create those utility. And for that, you are getting rewarded for doing that. And now, um, like, I like what illustration somebody gave the other time. And I said, one of the longest, one of the biggest problems that people run away, especially venture capitalists, that people who have saved a lot of money, have maybe they're retired, they have gathered a lot of money, and they're afraid of putting their money in crypto, they say it's too volatile. <clears throat> if you if you doubt it, if you meet people who are trading Forex, many of us don't understand. It's because some of us who are in crypto, we don't care whatever the volatility, but in reality, it's highly volatile. Why? Most time, because it's not getting stable yet. And everybody will like, that's why sometimes people who trade forex will say, I would rather trade currency pairs rather than trading gold. Why? The movement of gold is high because it's a, a, an asset of interest. Now, but when it comes to pairs of currency to another, maybe euro to USD or USD to euro, whatever, you can't expect like one minute move in a day. It, that's going to be terrible. That's a total crash. But that's a place where you're going to see a coin that will do five 500% uh, in a day that's crazily abnormal to them, and that's true in financial instrument. So, but why are we saying this? We said crypto is an opportunity that can maximize a lot of things. Now, I come to this point and look at it. This is a project you are investing into. Look at the stability of this platform. Now, in the month of December, that's from December to now, in the month of December, it has only have one losing month which is the month of April. And if I go to show you other cryptos, I probably let me go by Bitcoin. Let's go to Bitcoin and so that we'll tell you what we diversify and why we're just getting more stuff in this project. If you look at Bitcoin, right? So Bitcoin have had about three losing months, right? Why you have these losing just about, how many losing months? About one losing month. And the stability is high. Then if you go back to other cryptos that are actually crazily volatile, maybe if I go to Avas. Okay, now look at the some coins that are crazily volatile. You can see in the Avas, you have this one losing month, this is losing month, this is losing month, this is losing month, this is losing month. You're fine. You have some month profit and all of that. But where are many of us we know that, okay, somebody who have invested in Avas in the month of um, December, 
how are we know how are we going to know that you should take profit in that December and not buy in the month of or to now start buying in the month of January? So chances are there that you are a new investor, you are going to be buying the month of January. And if you end in negative, you are angry and you sell. And funny enough, in the month of February, he went up say, if I had known, I wouldn't have sold. These are the things that we said. It is very easy to make money in crypto, but it's very difficult to keep that money you make in crypto because not everyone have the knowledge. So why am I showing us all of this? I'm showing us opportunity in the crypto space that can build you salary regularly, very stable salary structure. And why? You are coming as a liquidity provider into the maintaining of the consensus of this blockchain or this coin, which is called Paynet. Now, I may not be able to have too much detailed technical aspect of it. You ask me, okay, how do I make money in Paynet? So I'll just show you one of the stable aspect of it. Now, for some persons, and that, like our last meeting, one of the fantastic solutions a lot of people asked questions and were provided was amazing, and which we're going to tell you to, uh, in the course of this training. So Paynet as a platform, what do they actually do? In the video you watch, you talk about online booking. And I must tell you, trust me, uh, in 2022, I think around June, when Mr. Obama told me about this project, and I was in a meeting with the developer and all of that, and I asked a lot of questions. The, what they listed were about five major stuff around that exchange is going to be created. As at that time, there was nothing like an exchange. Number two, they talked about we're going to be creating an online booking, flight booking. We are going to create a hotel reservation platform. We're going to create uh, an exchange that you don't only trade crypto, but you trade stock with it. And we're going to create um, uh, so many things about five major stuff and all of that. And okay, okay, no problem. I say, okay, who cares? What am I going to do? Let me just put in a little money and just allow you to be there. Not even logging in, not checking anything. I said, as usual. All right. And one of, one of the things he told me, say, oh, these people have been on me for more than nine months, but I'm not comfortable because, of course, you know, we have invested in so much money and we lose money. And he said, but this time around, I think these guys are serious and there was no hype, no ma no online marketing, no sponsor ad and all of that. He said, I think they are getting more serious and let's go. And now in that process, we have seen that some of you, as you are watching me now, we are now seeing that like the online booking, flight booking engine platform had been created. And one of the things I've seen is that creating this platform is that if I want to book on this uh, platform, I will have to use the coin to book. So everything I want to do, I want to do hotel reservation, I want to do flight reservation, and I want to do online shopping and activities, and there's a portal for it. So after now, you deserve, uh, you desire to have some of those links can be sent to you. And we saw that everything they were actually doing was to create utility around the token, which is amazing. And if there's any wonderful thing I've listened, if you don't know, know this. If there's any wonderful thing I've listened to CZ, that's the CEO of um, Binance, I, I start to be corrected or former, let me just say that. And he said something he said because he was the first guy that created a kind of an idea for an exchange to have an internal token. And one of the things he said is that, no, he said every strong company that create their own token we try to create utility around the token. And number two, we don't give that token out as a collateral because they will protect it. And if you go and check, one of the first things that brought about downfall about FTX as an exchange was that the token was used as a collateral. And of course, when you use your token, that's your assets as a collateral, then anybody can dump it as they like because you won't be able to manage or monitor or to actually stabilize. And many of us will not understand it, even the financial system or in the government policy, government fiscal policies, about when you don't have a strong hold on your currency, you can continue to lose. That's like what Nigeria is facing now, right? And because you cannot actually uh, revamp and, and you know strengthen your currency because you have no rule, uh, power over it, as it were. So this platform have been creating all of those things even when they were not there before, but they were being listed as things to be done. I think among many other things they have said, it's only thing to be added is that trading stock on their FMCP platform and every other thing has been traded. And now, so you ask me, fellas, okay, all this story you have told us, how do I make money in it? And I just have to show you this route for you to understand that, okay, where is this money making coming from? And how do they now revamp and restabilize you know, their token? And one of the lovely things about it is that I think that at that time, the price of the token was average about um, average of um, eight cent to nine cent. And it kept rigmaroling around that price. I quickly will just go to see what was the current price. Okay. Uh, CoinGecko. So, and this token kept revolving around 
that price, we make it look so uninteresting to buy. But many of us didn't know that what we'll have done should have been that we should just go and invest and be making passive money. Okay? Now, that's about two years ago. So the token was seated less than three penny. So that's not, this not even up to a cent. Right? And then the coin continued to go. And the highest it has done, about 50, 57 cents. Now, so when we saw that, we saw, okay, what's this coin? And one of the lovely things I listened to when uh, one of the guys was talking about it was that, hey, you know, you know what? This token will not be pumping and dumping because it does not attract the attention of speculators. So why? Stability is just there that I'm not. And after all, I, I'm investing to support the, the solidity of their ecosystem. I'm going to be getting paid in the stable coin, which is USDT. So that picked me to a point of then how do I make money in this project? And of course, we say a project that I've been running for the past, um, you know, three years. Before we come in, we come in two years ago. And then the thing I've been running without either we believe or we don't believe it has been doing what it was doing. And that's what it was. Now, so what, what we checked was that, okay, this project, how do I make money on it? So, okay, you can be a venture capitalist, even if you are a retailer. How? To support the liquidity of the ecosystem. We are doing all this project. Okay, so you are, are not interested probably in buying the coin or trading the coin, but I'm interested in staking into the coin. And I can tell you that uh, many, I've been in fans of staking, not this year, for many years. And one of the things I've seen in crypto is that most coins that does not have staking platform always have a pump and dump activities. Go and check. All right? And then we have a lot of staking that actually not a stable staking. Okay? And so we now say, okay, what can happen? One of the biggest opportunities you can have here is that you can invest and hold your peace and make money. And that's what I'm going to show you. Number one, we said, and if you look at when you've been invited, anyone I tell about this project was that, are you ready or interested to make salary in a place for the next 24 months? And if you're interested, then I'm going to show you a place where you can be making a regular salary on a monthly basis, even though it's accumulating every day and to make average of 9% of your, you know, in invested uh, uh, amount, and then regularly for the next 24 months. And what happened? Your rental money is still returned back to you after the 24 month expiration. That looks so impossible. But the truth is that the percentage is not an issue. Because I, I told friends I make money, I've traded, and I can make like 1,000%. But hear me, most of us who are traders, and I said, I have been saying this time with a number. I said, if I give you $500 and I fund your future account, sport account, or forex, synthetics, and I ask you, go and trade. I've always been telling people, I say, I will give you $500. Fund your account, and then we'll keep monitoring your account. Trade it for 12 calendar months. And I monitor you, you trade it for 12 calendar months. Today you make profit, tomorrow you lose, and all of that. And at the end of 12 calendar months, you come back, we open the account, and the $500 is still there. I'm not saying profit. I don't even tell you to make profit. Trade it, you lose, you make, you lose, but you are able to struggle that the capital is there without adding new fund. The following year, I will upgrade you to say you are a good and professional trader. You may not understand. Why? If you check yourself now, so many of us who have been trading, it is if you have made it now, it's not the first fund, not second fund, not third fund, especially in forest, that has actually grown to the amount. And I've seen that most of us, what we do is that we actually say to be professional, but eventually we gamble the money. So it's actually difficult to build your wealth. So you can gamble you make today, tomorrow you don't make and all of that. So that's not about the whole thing. So now here, how do I get involved in this and how do I actually make money? I say you are making an average of seven, uh, 9% on a monthly basis, when you become a staker into this project. And this is where I'm going to show you. I'm sure Mr. Ibami will tell us one or two things thereafter. Now, how do I make that? So, okay, be a partaker of staking at least about $3,000 into this platform. And then what happened? You're going to make average of 9% every blessed month. 9% of $3,000 every month is about $270. I wouldn't live to convert it to Naira, but I know minimum it will be in Naira is about 400000 Naira. So on a monthly basis, you're going to make that salary. 
Oh, I'm interested to make more than that salary. Okay, increase your game. So that is to say, uh, because the highest package you can pick in this platform is $3,000, but you can load as many number of this $3,000 package as possible. So if I want to load about 10 times, that's going to be 30,000. So what it then means is that 9% of each of 3,000, which is $270. Now $270 multiplied by 10, that's going to give you about uh, $2,700, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, so $270 multiplied by 10, that's going to give us about $2,700. That means on a monthly basis, you're going to make an average of $2,700 with your $30,000 passive income. And now at the end of 24 months, your whole money is made. And then that is you just take and then remove your hand. Then when after expiration, you have your capital given. So what we now say is that because scripturally, what you have brought in, because that's one of the mindset that keep me flowing in the space. Any money you deposit into a platform, if really you understand your scripture, it's not your money any longer. It's referred to as seed. And what the scripture say about seed is that until it's a wheat of corn fall into the ground and die, it abides alone. So that means literally that your $3,000 was no longer money, but was a seed and must die. And so as long as it's dead, and that's why the company say, okay, since this $3,000 was already dead, that you should expect at the end of your expiration, this dead money should have totally been up to 310%. Which means that your $3,000 that is gone or dead should have been able to build up to give you about $9,300. That's what it means. If you do the arithmetic, $310 percent. So altogether with the money that is, the $3,000 is now zero. So you should expect casting your bread upon the waters. So what you're expecting is 310 percent. But every month, you have been paid $270, and then after the expiration, the $3,000 is given, and that will have cumulatively be up to $9,300. You heard me right. And so how do I get activation? Now, one of the lovely things about this project is that if I want to activate my account, here it is. Remember, you want to book flight. It has to be this token. You want to do hotel reservation. It has to be this token. You want to trade. is this token. You want to do whatsoever. It's actually revolving around this token. And for that, that means for me to activate my account, uh, perhaps maybe whoever must have invited you, we need you to register again on their exchange. However, the token self can be purchased on CoinStore. I've checked a different exchange that is available on CoinStore and all of that. I experimented that. So, but you need a coin uh, FMC pay to buy. And what do I do? That means the volume you have bought is being deposited into the platform. That means you are supporting the liquidity of the, of the project. And then having done that, you are getting paid on a monthly basis. And then at the end of the day, at the end of the expiration, your 3000 is given back to you. All right. Then people may now ask, now, if you don't do 3000, that means you are not going for the 9% monthly salary I talk about. Doing 1,000 will only give you 7%. And so 7% of 1,000 should be about $70 every month. That is if you want to do any lower package, 1,500 and all of that. So that's just the basic, the first thing. If you look at, this is an example here. If you look at this account, what do they say here? $3,000 package pick here. And it says, okay, this is 9,000. That total money that will be withdrawable after you have done this 3,000 big that become a seed and is dead, you should expect output of this $9,300, all right? And then if you look at it now, that is, this account probably have withdrawn about $1,635. What it means is that if this account now says, okay, I don't only want to make money passively and I want to actively be involved, then that means the whole expiration may come faster than you ever expected. Okay, now if you look at what has accrued here, because this monthly, which is $270 on that 3000 it actually come on a daily basis, which is about average of $9. And if you look at it now, what has accrued to this place is 104 What do I do? I can go ahead if I want to make a withdrawal of this same amount. All right, this is, uh, this is how much? About $104. It's just for me to type it here. All right. And I click what? Withdraw. Now, the moment I click withdraw, I'm not paying any charges for me to withdraw it from the staking into my dashboard, which is going to be in the payment token. 
okay? Which is going to be in the payment token instantly at the prevailing exchange rate. That's why you are seeing 200 and pin, 201 payment token, all right? So if I go to the staking now, you're going to see that that amount has been withdrawn, okay? Can you see now? That amount has been withdrawn, making this guy to be $1,739, as it were. So what am I showing us? It's very simple, not technical, not too complicated. But one of the things is that if things are too technical and all of that can be so boring and people say, oh, what am I going to be doing? All right. And that's one of the major aspects of this project. So you withdraw and then it can be sent to your FMCP and it can be converted to any of these tokens you desire and can be withdrawn to come. Many Nigerians will ask me, if I finish investing here, how do I take it back to my bank account? The question I always ask, uh, the response I always give to you is that invest first and then we'll show you the exit plan. Then the other aspect are people who have time to be actively involved into this project. So ladies and gentlemen, we have just shown you an escape way, you know, to reduce unnecessary stress. Now, I have this for some of us who are crypto trader, you know, mem, mem token, low gem tokens trading and all of that. One of the things that frustrates many investors in crypto or traders in crypto is the fact that you can buy a coin, all right? You can buy a coin right now and the coin will be doing well. Unfortunately, we just dump. And that's one of the things that have made you not to be able to build portfolio. And so, but if you have a stable platform that is generating you income, now when you needed a coin, just like imagine this like $104 I just withdraw now and I want to go and buy a meme coin. Why not? Example, somebody was just starting me the other time that is a token I asked them to buy with day uh, was um, Nero. He used $8, okay? He used $8 to buy the token. As I were talking now, the token, the amount of that money is worth about $240. Now, so imagine you have $100, yes? So in a month, this token has done 4,000%. Now, for the fact that this token has done 4,000%, it's an opportunistic period. So imagine you have withdrawn $110 from your pay net back office and you have bought the token. So somebody used $8 to get $240. So imagine you $50 and then you have made a lot of money. So ladies and gentlemen, just tease of the ice band. So that's the opportunity we have for you. And those of you who have been leveraging uh, on this, uh, I think you can attest to that. I was chatting with somebody who stayed where. He said, sir. The only project that have been paying me for the past two years now have been paying it. He said, it's quite unfortunate for me that um, all the investment I did, nothing was working. He said he got angry, having done one a $3,000 package, that she got angry and upgraded and did additional nine uh, portions, which is 3,000 times nine, 27,000 to make it 30,000. He said, that's what I've been paying in my salary. I pay my bill. I buy some other coins I want to buy and all of that. Especially, we are going close to the end of the bull run, probably till the next year, middle or maybe quarter, the second or third quarter of next year. And you know the experience that normally happens. People make noise during bull run. At the bear market, they disappear. And that's exactly what you are doing. You make a lot of money and you don't have a place to get stabilized, to get stable income. That can be very traumatic. So ladies and gentlemen, thank you for the opportunity and the time of listening. Uh, I think at this point in time, I will have to hand over to Mr. Yobami who have one or two things. And of course, if you have questions, I will, I will love that you write down those questions and of course, you'll be attentive accordingly. So thank you very much for coming and, thank, and sorry for the um, uh, the inconveniences we call or discrepancies we called earlier. And then that's what he had explained to you. Uh, Mr. Yobami, are you there? Thank you very much, Mr. Felix. Thank you, everyone. Uh, all the 26 people on this call, thank you so much uh, for your patience. We, uh, you know, it's it been awesome. All right, so uh, without wasting much of our time, I will actually ask if you have any questions, you can ask. Mr. Ben has actually demystified everything. He has shown us, shown us everything that we need to know about uh, Penet coin, um, the staking rewards uh, being um, a personal story, um, 2021, um, Tony told me about um, Penet coin in the month of June 6, 2029. Um, I didn't listen to him. We had a team Zoom meetings in 11 months. So after 11 months, I said, okay, this guy that has been going 
and come in. At the time he started, he, you know, he shared this opportunity with me. There was nothing like exchange. There was nothing like, you know, the token trading anywhere. As a matter of fact, it was even USDT we were staking then. You know, we were staking USDT, and then we're using it to collect, the, you know, Penet coin and all of that. At the time, the price of the Penet coin was um, uh, 0 0.08, uh, you know. But it took me 11 months. You know, after 11 months, I I jumped in on it, and I told Mr. Felix, showed it to a couple of other people, uh, but because, you know, we've had uh, some terrible experiences, we decided to, you know, take it slow and steady. Now, personally, I put in uh, 15000 in, uh, in when I started in the month of May 2022, I put in 15000 And that 15000 at the time was giving me $1,350 every month, which was giving me, you know, uh, a very sizable number of tokens uh, on monthly basis upon um, conversion. I was making about um, 16,875 coins per month. And, you know, uh, this lingered on for like eight months. Um, so in eight months, I've actually made about 135 coins basically on, you know, my 15,000 stake. So what I do basically is to just take out of this money, sometimes, you know, solve uh, one or two issues, uh, bills, pay some bills, because the coin is relatively very, very stable. Okay, so then I was keeping some, I was spending some, I was using some to build other crypto portfolio since that is the only thing I do um, uh, for now. Okay, so uh, I was, you know, doing all of that. And before you know it, boom, the price of the coin started moving. And today, we are sitting at 51 cents, you know, per, per coin. I remember sharing with someone that time, and the person was speaking English. And I told him straight, I said, you know what? In Nigeria of today, if you're not doing something to edge your funds against inflation, then it's a matter of time, one will be caught in the web. Of, of struggles and uh, God forbid one is only any Naira, you know, in Nigeria today, you know what it means. Uh, when Mr. Felix was talking, he said, you know, make money in dollars, spend it in Naira, leaves you, you are, you don't really feel whether they are selling fuel at 1,200 Naira or fuel or a bag of rice at 200,000 Naira or whatever, because you only need to take a little to, you know, to do uh, what you need to do. Uh, uh, by time. And we are doing this basically because we want a better life for ourselves and then uh, for our family without having to struggle. You understand? So uh, that is basically why, you know, for me, Penet coin, yes, other coins have been doing, you know, we've been following the cycle. You make money, here, this one drops, that one drops. But for me, on monthly basis, uh, Penet coin has been very, very, you know, uh, stable in terms of uh, the monthly uh, reward. When my then the one beautiful thing again is that when your when your time when your time you know your staking contract ends, your capital is returned to you over a period of you know five months. Yes, uh, in the three three thousand uh, package, you have your capital returned back to you, which you can do anything. So when my fifteen thousand is expired in the month of uh, me this year, you know, I started collecting, but, but from the backlog, the ones I've stayed that I've collected, I've kept, I was able to do additional 13 slots, 13 slots, you know, uh, of, 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 of this uh, particular stuff. So that is generating something in the neighborhood of $3,510 on monthly basis. Uh, even if I say, okay, you know what, I want to be doing as if I'm going to office and I'm doing 30 days make a month, that is $3,500 per month that, you know, uh, I'll be taking home on a personal note. And then we are, I mean, I have people that have put in 63000 into this project, and in two years, they've made more than 600000 Because, you know, like I said, 
the price of the coin kept increasing. It will stay in a place for a while. It increases, and then the result was an explosion, you know, after the contract. So what do you think will happen to that kind of person? Someone that makes 60-something, 70-something thousand from 63,000 investment, and then over and above everything, uh, he, the, the project is running. He will simply do what they wanted to do with ease, and then still put in some good amount of money into the, the goods that lays the golden egg. So for everything that Mr. Felix has said, that is all that we need to know as far as the uh, Pinet coin is concerned. The user, the echo, the ecosystem is increasing, is growing. Um, the, you, I mean, you've been showed, you know, you've been told about you using, you know, Pinet coin for booking hotels, for flight tickets. And besides, is a whole lot of uh, a realistic uh, uh, approach, you know, that the, the company is using to bring the uh, projects to you know, to the limelight, okay? Um, in a couple of, I mean, the blockchain, FMCP blockchain is going to come alive. Then we'll be having launch pad, we'll be having DEXs on it. So you, you can imagine, you can envision where the payment coin itself is going. And for everything you do on FMCP, you are using payment coin, either on AFF or the stake. Of, of Mr. Felix about how the funds could get into our Nigerian bank account. I I heard say I will allow you a exit plan. Can this made can this made clearer? Well, if what you're asking, uh, that is uh, Mr. O, Mr. Abatunde. Okay, if what you're asking is how you convert your money into Naira, that is actually easier than uh, converting your physical dollar, even into Naira, okay? Uh, the, eco the crypto ecosystem is uh, robust. You can either do P2P, you know, collect your money from, uh, take it to USDT, uh, you know, where you, are, where you want to convert, take it to maybe another exchange where you, where you have the likes of Bybit and all, you can do your P2P from there, or, you want to even say, okay, you don't want to use that for but personally. I don't use all those P2P personally. I have exchanges that you know I deal with personally, like I said. Okay. And these exchanges, it will interest you to know that the way we have their bookings, you know, uh the Malams deal on physical dollar. We have exchanges that all they do is digital currencies as well. So for you to convert your money to dial into your bank account is the easiest, easiest thing. Go and make the money first. Then, you know, when you get to the point you want to convert it to Naira, whoever invites you to this platform has, you know, a very easy way of exiting, you know, uh, uh, into your bank account. I hope that answers your question, okay? Okay, somebody is asking, is there a referral bonus? Absolutely. You know, when you do the business, so we we have the investment, um, uh, we have the business. Um, so when you do the business, there are three basic uh, incomes that you can make, which everything is explained. You know, on this, on the, on the, on the platform. Number one, when you are doing the business, you are on three thousand package. You invite anybody on three thousand package, you have a one hundred fifty dollars welcome bonus. That is given to you. One hundred fifty dollars is given to you. That's number one. That's instant bonus, which you can withdraw effectively you know, immediately. Then um, we have the second bonus. It's called the matching bonus because this is a this is a binary. You know the business aspect of it runs on binary. Okay, so where, where you have uh, your right and your left on your weak leg, if you're on three thousand package, you are paid eight percent of the total revenue that you've generated on your weekly. So let's assume you have um, you have uh, ten or uh, nine thousand on your right leg, and you have six thousand on your left leg. 
So your total revenue will be six thousand. So six thousand, you are you are eligible to earning eight percent of the six thousand be your matching bonus. Okay, that's the that's the second revenue. But mind you, uh, on your three thousand, the maximum amount you can make is nine thousand three hundred dollars. Okay, nine thousand three hundred dollars. Now you making nine thousand three hundred dollars. It's it encompasses your reward based on staking, your matching bonus, and your fast start bonus. Everything goes into that nine thousand three hundred. So the day you max out your account, so so you know you're staking three thousand dollars. It runs for twenty four months, but you can max it out in one week. I've maxed out an account in three weeks before. So in three weeks, I made my nine thousand three hundred dollars from the three thousand dollars I staked. Then I had to reinvest on that particular account to keep making money because the window of of money making on my initial three thousand was closed, you know, because um, I'm I'm using it to you know do the business. So what I do is I have business accounts separately and I have the investment account separately. Okay, so that is that. Then the third bonus that you, you are you are eligible to earn is the bonus. That is the ranking bonus. That one does not have anything to do with your 9,003 because you can earn as much as $50,000 on that particular ranking bonus in a month, depending on how you grow your business, okay? All that is explained at the back end of the AFM 2024 uh, portal. Okay, I hope that answers your question, uh, Mr. Michael, okay? Mr. Okay, Bank B, you say Nigerian government approved two exchanges, charging money in Naira to exactly. So that's another thing. That's another way where you, you can use um two, there are two exchanges that have been approved by Nigerian uh, bank uh, by Nigerian government, federal government, where you can use, you know, to move your money from you know any border to you know the other the exchanges. I hope those answer your questions. Do we have any other question? Do we have any other question? Any other question? Please, if you have more questions, feel free to ask so that you can be clarified as better as possible. Please, you have any question, just, you can just uh, type it again, or you can put it up on your digital hands and so that you'll be back on to ask your question please kindly ask question if you do have any question please okay uh, i think uh, maybe they are they are good um so please uh, for those of us you are uh, you've heard we have event in lagos that will be on the 26th if i'm not mistaken by this end of as towards the end of this month you are in lagos or you have friends there wherever you are so either you are in lagos or not you have friends other places uh, where you live, then just you know think about them, and then invite them. Let's let's have some titi at it. It's going to be a very fantastic event, and an eye opening event for people to see. Uh, just like what we said, you can you can make you can make insane money in one day, but if you don't know how to uh make consistent money, you can be frustrated. I've seen a lot of people make a lot of money uh within the shortest time, but thereafter they they keep uh, say bros your your boy day. You know, you now ask what's going on. So money making, uh, I said money making uh, is more difficult. Uh, money making food to eat food is more difficult than to make money. That is, anybody can make money. So it's more difficult eating food. So money making is easier than eating food. Okay. But this is the point. The point is that you can make a lot of money, but to preserve and build wealth is more very difficult. Okay. Somebody say. How many days is the event, sir? Okay, it's to be one day, and then we can have leadership follow up uh, that same day and the following day in the office. And so, but the office will be given to us at uh, the moment you're on the group, or perhaps um, you come to the event, and then we'll give you where the office is. But of course, be sure that you are not going to go far to locate the office. It's office still at the Kedja there and all of that. So it's a one day event, and it's going to be very, very powerful. It's going to be a postatory and more detail that you can have more better interaction. So you have friends in Lagos, you are in Lagos, get prepared. And those of us who are in Lagos, please, let's send a hands of fellowship to people. 
And then our own is to share. Our decision is to be made by the people you share with. But the worst is not to share. The worst not to share. Okay, I think we are good. Um, since no more questions, get back to whoever invited you. Do the needful. And uh, somebody say, what's the next when's the next meeting? I think every Saturday. Uh, it's every Saturday. But I know that this Saturday we're going to do the event. Uh, what we do is that uh, probably we may just uh, do a kind of live stream. So on the Saturday event, it's going to be um, a live stream. So but next Saturday is another meeting. And then you can invite your friends. And of all, by the grace of God, we believe that um, uh, Mr. Tony and Dr. Daniel will be uh, around that time. And then so that we can have more detailed interaction. All right, I think we have done justice to the meeting. Thank you for turning up. And then I'm sure you're going to utilize every opportunity presented to you. Uh, do not have a nice weekend and um, see us where to your family and everyone. Thank you. Thank you very much, everyone. Thank you. You have a lovely weekend. Enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you.